Meteorologist Bruce Sussman. Well, our weather's better than most places around the country today and tonight. And let's start with a 24 hour forecast. Looking at tonight's forecast first. At 7 o'clock, we're still going to be right around that 80 degree mark, if you can believe that. By 9 o'clock, it is like a summer night, 74 degrees, and finally cooling into the upper 60s at 11. Overnight, we do cool off. So, you know, if you've got a windows open situation at your house, you'll be able to get some cooler air in overnight. 8 a.m., we're 60 and mostly sunny skies, mostly sunny at noon, and 73 tomorrow, and then another high temperature around 84 by the time we get to this time tomorrow night. One of the driving factors around here, the way we started the day, just clear skies, beautiful sunrise, right, coming up and just instantly starting to get our temperatures warming. And right now it continues to be incredibly clear. I mean, we don't have a ton of days each year where there's just not even a cloud in the sky, but that's the case right now looking over the West Hills and right over those of you in Portland State. Just beautiful, clear skies. 84 degrees, a bit of a northwest breeze has kicked up, and that'll keep our temperatures from climbing much more. 82, the high so far in Salem, and we had 80s lots of places. In fact, the Dow's almost made it to 90 today. We are virtually cloud free for the night ahead on both sides of the Cascades and even along the coast. There's not much going on right now as far as clouds. A little mini marine layer may develop up there tonight, but nothing significant. High pressure still right where it has been. It's actually advanced inland a little bit since this time yesterday, and that puts the storm track way up here. And honestly, what's out here is not very strong either. So the rain is going to the north, what little there is of it. Now we're looking ahead to the weekend, and I think things will start to cool down by the weekend, but not cold. Still great weather for the Grand Floral Parade. And your forecast breakdown, when this thing rolls out of the Memorial Coliseum on Saturday morning, it should be partly sunny and in the upper 50s. Now we get our way into the afternoon. It's still partly sunny around here, but it's in the low 70s by the time this thing wraps up near Lincoln High School at 2 o'clock. On Saturday. So great parade weather ahead. What about tomorrow? It's our rain and cloud forecast, starting mostly sunny here in the valley. There you see the low clouds along the coastline. They should be brief, maybe a few high clouds passing over our skies. That's tomorrow at noon. And a couple of clouds over the coast range. That should about do it for our weather tomorrow. So patchy morning clouds along the coast. Otherwise, it's more sunshine inland. We'll see mid 80s for those of you in the central and southern valley. Pushing 90 some places east of the Cascades, including the Dalles at 90 tomorrow, and still 70 for a high temperature on government camp. Here in the metro area, we start in the upper 50s. We warm to 84 degrees in Portland. And I think it's mostly sunny again tomorrow. Temperatures a virtual repeat from what we saw today. So it's almost like if you like today, you're going to love tomorrow. That's kind of how the forecast breaks down. 84 for a high in Vancouver. So here's your seven day forecast. And the key is for the grand floor or the junior rose parade tomorrow, you definitely want some sunscreen or a hat for the kids. Otherwise, it's going to be a great day. Thursday, some more clouds pass through and we cool a little bit. And that trend picks up speed into the weekend, but it's still really fantastic weather. I don't have any rain in the forecast. Mm. And as you know, the joke is, you know, the Rose Festival low usually brings us endless showers and I rain, know. right? And it's a joke for a reason because it's true. Well, we lucked out this year. We really have. So the next time we complain, say, hey, remember 2012? Remember last year. That's what I'm going to tell or you no, next wait, year. Or no, wait, 2013. Whatever year it is. <laughs> whatever year it is. <laughs> they kind of rolled together. It was nice. It was a nice okay, one. Okay, <laughs> thank you. Thank you, Bruce. All I right. do know what year it is.